One of the things we talk about in my Come Near to God workbook and today, let's talk about fear. And you're thinking, why, is that, why am I talking about fear here in Cozumel? There are reasons why we have fear in our life. And what is your fear? Do you know? And how do you respond? What is your soul, your brain, your body, your temple, and your heart tells you? Or your environment at the same time? Do you know? Fear is not from God. And our soul and our body can be overwhelmed with fear. As you are in this healing and deliverance process, we want to find things that are hinders in our spiritual walk and fear is one of them because we keep having those fearful thoughts and emotions you can develop to sin keep it up and it has a spirit of fear and for god did not give you a spirit of fear but a spirit of power love and a sound mind right perfect love dries out all fear so as you are doing things and filter your thoughts daily and any of the negative thoughts ask the holy spirit Am I having some fearful thoughts? Some people are have, are scared to get on boats. Some people are scared to scuba dive. Some people are scared of swimming. What is What are yours? It doesn't have to be water. I just happen to be here for my birthday trip and I just wanna share with you that fear is not from God and fear with Jesus, with Jesus and through Jesus, you can conquer it, whatever you're fearful and have positive, put some positive, uh, self-talk and scriptures renewing the mind is going to be okay and ask Jesus for strength and he will help you and just do everything through Jesus because you are the righteousness of God if fear does not come from Jesus and just know that you're worthy you're worthy and ask God for help he will help you and then you can go from there but renew the mind soldier renew the mind positive self-talk and scriptures you may have to put your hand on your head, soul calm down in Jesus' name, or body calm down in Jesus' name. I repent and release all fears, the anxiousness, nervousness, fear of the unknown, and fear of, and then you list the fears. Okay, those are just a few golden nuggets. Until next time, just know you're the righteousness of God.